guys, so today I'm going to be reviewing the Stila Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. And basically I had to get on here and review it because I mentioned this eyeliner in several videos, I've used it in several tutorials, I don't even remember which, but I really love this product and so I figured I might as well just do a an actual review about it and um, you know, let you guys know exactly why I love it so much. So basically the first awesome thing about it is the tip is very very fine and obviously if you're trying to do a winged eyeliner or just a thin line of liquid eyeliner like I have today um, it's just it's very difficult to do if the tip is not extremely fine so um, that's the awesome thing about this eyeliner the next thing that's great is they are not lying when it says stay all day this is a very waterproof liquid eyeliner this is the liquid eyeliner I would recommend to you if you know, you were getting married, or if it was raining, like, so horribly out, you didn't have an umbrella or hat, and it was inevitable. Th this is what I'd recommend. It's very waterproof. So waterproof that you kind of got to scrub decently when you're using some makeup remover or makeup remover wipes. Um, so it can kind of actually get a little irritating. But, um, yeah. Also, the thing is, when you're removing, if you find it's very difficult to remove, if it's almost all the way gone, my tip for you is gently, like, scratch it off. It's almost like, um, I don't even know what you'd call it, but it's kind of like taking tape off a surface. You kind of just scratch it off and it's, it's completely done. It just needed a little extra work, so that's my tip for that. It's also obviously in a very sleek, slender package. I know some eyeliners, they kind of, I don't know why, they have fat packaging or, you know, it's just, eh, so... This is very convenient, easy to store, easy to use. And also getting back to the tip, it is a felt tip. I don't know about you, I love felt tips, I hate brushes. I have tried and tried to use liquid eyeliners with brush tips, and I just hate it. I mean, I hear a lot of people, makeup artists even, say how, oh, you should start with a liquid eyeliner uh, with a brush. I'm just like, are you kidding me? I mean, I can barely use one, let alone a beginner, so definitely I would recommend if you are a beginner with any kind of liquid eyeliner, go for the felt tip. You have a lot more control, and again, it's it's fine at the tip, whereas with a brush, if you're not, like, very, very careful with your hand and how you're moving, um, you're just going to paint your whole eyelid. So um, you have a lot more control with this. And another perk is it's in a pen format rather than the dipping kind of thing. You know how like some eyeliners it's like in a little pot and then you take out and you know this is just so easy to use. I, I just I love it. So I think I've highlighted everything but um it's just very easy to use. It really does stay all day. It's a great color. It comes in a variety of shades but I love brown and uh yeah. Ooh. And now it's in my hair. <laughs> how these things happen when I film. It's very weird, I know. So I definitely recommend this to any beginner, intermediate, advanced, expert, whatever you are. It's an amazing eyeliner. The only downside is the price. I think it's like $20. I mean, if you're used to spending that amount, go ahead. I'm not. I'm more of a drugstore junkie. Um, but honestly, this is worth the $20 to me. I'm dead serious. And if, I, if that's coming from me, you know I love it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Please give it a thumbs up if you did and share with your friends. And subscribe for more videos because I make them every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday on this channel. And check out my vlog channel if you haven't already for some random goodness. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next one, guys. Bye.